Hi, it's me, Vamp. And we have to talk about Vampire Kavat in Warframe. Now, as some of you guys may know, the dev stream happened just the other day. Um, there should be a card somewhere. I did a recap of it, and we vaguely mentioned, I vaguely mentioned about, um, Vampire Kvat, because they did mention it. I want to go into a little more detail about what I think that could entail, what, um, what it means for the future, what this, just in general, what I expect from this, which, I'll be honest, I'm not sure if anything will meet my expectations, because I was told that a certain revenant would be a vampire, but he wasn't. Okay, anyway, <clears throat> anyway, moving on, moving on, moving on. Okay. <laughs> So, Vampire Kavat. Let's read the description here. A new wildlife type is being introduced into the plains of Eidolon and will only spawn at night. This will be part of the conversion system, but you will also be able to get your own Vampiric Kavat involving your own poor non-vampire kavat. I wonder what that entails. Okay. So it seems like Rebecca made this initial comment on stream. Steve said, way to spoil it. So I'm wondering if it's just as simple as, you know, going into the planes at nighttime with a kabat that's not a vampire and it's turning vampire and if it's that simple then that's good to get the first vampire kabat but what happens so does that mean every single time at night time i have to avoid taking my kabat i mean my normal media kabat into um the planes at night and furthermore um okay so rebecca said on stream that this is meant to be like the cavat version of the helmet charger for the kubo which would be fine and dandy but but hedra i'm hoping i'm hoping I really, because I love, like, whatever um, Kavat you have, like the vampire just upgrades it, just changes its ability around a little bit, like just a little shift, like, in the abilities. So you could say the vampire Kavat is like the ultimate form of that Kavat, or is it... Is that something like literally the Kavat just bites your Kavat and then you get a message when you get to your ship like, oh, since it read your Kavat dying, you need to do blah, blah, blah in order to save it. Collect 500 blood vials from the Grenier. Um, collect 10,000. I don't know. I'm just making a numbers here, okay? Saying stuff that I think would be vampire-y and cool. But in reality, what I think it is, I think Vampire Kabat is going to be its own um, pet type, which I'm wondering what it could entail. What could it do? I'm going to assume that it somehow gets life, but that's all I can assume it does. And I'll be honest, I'm really, really hoping that it's better than my Smeeda Kavat. Because even though my Smeeda Kavat doesn't proc all the time, it's still more efficient to take a Smeeda Kavat 
to have that chance of it proccing than it is to take any other cavat at the moment. Now, the same with Azura, I guess, the certain situation, that's the other cavat type. So, yeah, this cavat type, it looks like it's going to be, from what Rebecca said, fairly easy to get, but, you know, that's subject to change. Maybe since Rebecca mentioned something about it being easy to get, now it's going to be harder, I don't know. Clearly, from the second picture, we see that the model is in-game and reacting accordingly. So, what we can take away from that is that we should be getting this fairly soon. I would predict that with the mainline update um, on PC toward the end of this month, um, in case you're wondering how I got that answer, that we're getting a mainline update at all, um, feel free again to check the dev stream recap that I did. They actually told that much on the dev stream. Um, like I said, that should be a card, top right hand corner, click the eye, that should be a video you can click on and go watch. And yeah, that will be interesting to see. I'll be on it, PC, as you guys know, I am a PS4 main, but PC, so PC will definitely be getting this update first. I think I'll let them see how the Kava it changed first. You know, I don't, <laughs> let's be real, I don't know if I want to give up my Kava, like, you know, Gonzo for, Gonzo forever type thing. I can just imagine taking a Smita into the planes at night, and then it being gone forever. And, I can only assume that it would be better solo, right? I mean, well, because I'm assuming you can kill the wild vampire Kabat, and if you can, then, you know, I feel like a squad would just kill them, right? And did they scale to the level of whatever bounty you're doing? The, can they it'll be doing a bounty and they appear? Do you have to just be going in idle not doing a bounty? So many unanswered questions. But I feel like you guys knew I'd probably make a video just on the Vampire Kavat. I mean, my name is Vamp for crying out loud. Vampire Kavat. Uh, something that I never thought I needed until they announced it. So yeah, the vampire frame was kind of a bust, unfortunately. But I have high hopes for the vampire Kavat guy. Very high hopes indeed. And with that, I'm actually going to end the video. I just wanted to talk a bit about the vampire Kavat. Feel free to leave your guys' you know, reaction to this in the comment section below. Do you guys like the idea of the Vampire Kavat? Do you hate it? Do you hope it's as easy as just taking a Kavat into the planes at nighttime? Do you not want it to be that easy? Because if it's that easy, then you might lose your Kavat forever. Do you hope it's better than the other Kavats? Do you think it's something cool, but you don't really want to carry it around at all with you ever? But yeah, definitely let me know what you guys think. Comment section below. Feel free to smash that like button if you liked this video. Punch that bell icon if you want to be notified of future videos right when I release them and feel free to subscribe if you're not subscribed already i'll catch you guys next time later